The ambulance comes. They pronounce him dead at the scene. I was done. End of this story. As the ambulance raced towards Cedar sinai Hospital, fate took a strange turn. One of the paramedics, a Motley Crue fan, refused to give up on him. He ripped off Nikki's shirt and plunged in a needle. They gave me two shots of adrenaline. Nikki's heart started beating again. I was dead two minutes. And they brought me back. That you had attempted to jump off an eighth floor balcony of the Hyatt on Sunset Boulevard in 2003, but somehow she stopped you. But then there's a contradiction that says uh, your friend Tom Hazard stopped Tom you. Tom Hazard. Tom yeah, Hazard. Biggie T. Yeah. If he hadn't grabbed me by the shirt, I would be a splatter on the, uh, on the pavement. So, yeah. so it was him who physically him, stopped yeah, you. Yeah. The bus, which was on its way from Bristol, had just come down Brassknocker Hill. It was planning to go this way, right along the A36, but instead it carried straight on, going through the trees, through the barriers, and right over there onto the bank opposite. On board, four guys who'd grown up together in New York, touring the UK as the rock band Baroness, along with their crew. Tonight should have been their last UK date in Southampton. They were travelling there, having been on stage at the Fleece in Bristol only yesterday. The witness told us he was a few hundred yards away last night, a few minutes before midnight, and saw what he called a fireball rolling across the highway. Then he saw the fireball crash into an embankment. He got closer and said he realized that it was a plane. One, Travis Barker, the former drummer for the group Blink-182, and the second, Adam Goldstein, known as DJ AM, a popular DJ in California. Both of those men have survived and were taken to a burn center in Augusta, Georgia, which is about an hour away from here. A normal pancreas is about the size of a fist. Years of hard drinking had caused Duffs to swell to the size of a football. As his pancreas continued to swell, it began to drip digestive acids between his intestines and skin. The acid had given him internal third-degree burns all the way down to his thigh muscles. I uh, overdosed and killed myself for about four minutes. You know, everybody makes mistakes, but I truly learn from my mistakes, and I have that ability to turn that light switch off and I'm going to keep that particular light switch off in my life forever. Us! 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 Ozzy! 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 Can you breathe? Stop the keys! Someone get back and get an ambulance. Get an ambulance to the house. I was just about to walk down the staircase. It was the beginning of the show. I I grabbed the railing, and I wasn't grounded properly. I got zapped with 220 volts. But luckily, it knocked me back, not down, oh forward. Boy. It knocked me back, because if it knocked me forward, I would have dropped, you know, 20 feet and broke my neck. So it knocked me back. My bodyguards came up, dragged me off, and I had burns on my hand, and I had lost feeling in it. And it took me, you know, a good 10, 15 minutes, but the audience started chanting Ace, Ace. And that got my adrenaline going and brought me back to life, and uh, I finished the show. We have these flashes of magnesium that burns at 1,200 degrees, 1,800 degrees, who knows, but hot enough to melt metal. James Hetfield looks like uh, that torch that they carry up the stairs to light the Olympic fire. So I'm burnt, all my arm, my hand completely down to the bone, the side of my face, hair gone, uh, part of my back. I said, you all right, man? He looked at me and he, he was shaking and he brought up his, his hand. And I could literally see the skin rising off his, his hand and blister. I got a phone call at 5.30, 6 a.m. at my room from the front desk saying, Mr. Reese, one of your uh, band members is passed out in front of the elevator on the sixth or fifth floor. So I throw on some pants, jump, run out my room, and Slash is dead. I mean, d dead, blue dead. He had no pulse. Paramedics show up, bam, the adrenaline right into his heart. 